what's unique about it to me is, you know, I, I know it's, I know it's a, a Los Angeles rivalry, a crosstown rivalry, and uh, I know it's got to be funny to some people who are uh, deep into that rivalry, and when they see, oh, wait a second, the, the coach is coaching both teams. I know Ramon, Ramon through, he's my original trainer. Um, I met him at the other gym that, that I originally started at, and he's the one that built me up from the very beginning. Um, he took me from, from nothing to uh, the, person, the fighter I am now. Tony was somebody that I was training before he got to college. He watched us build USC with Mike Evanisco. I tried to get Tony to go to USC so he could join the team there. And he said, no, I'm going to UCLA. Originally, I said, good luck with that. And um, I was supposed to help them find a coach. And that's what happened originally. Uh, they went through like two or three coaches that didn't work out. And so, uh, but I was training Tony the whole time. And eventually the whole club, when he brought his guys and we had SC together in the gym at the beginning, uh, he was kind of egging them on, like, come on, don't let these guys get us, that sort of thing. Uh, but it, it, it kind of quickly changed to uh, we're all working together type of atmosphere. And um, the, the thing for me is I think that a good adversary brings out the best in you. So uh, I tried to encourage uh, or, or foster that kind of environment for all of them and let them know that, yeah, these guys are our rivals, that sees the rival for UCLA, but uh, we're trying to bring out the best in each other and not kill each other's spirits. It does get a little heated sometimes, you know? We push each other, even when we're not sparring and we're just hitting the bags, we're doing drills, we, we push each other because we want each other to do well. We're friends, but there's been, other, there's been venues where we have competed against each other, and once we walk into that ring, we're not friends anymore. You know, we're we're in there to win. The rivalry is not. Uh, we we make jokes about it, but when it comes down to it, we're all like really good friends, and we're all trying to help each other. But at the same time, we host our LA fight, and uh, that the big event is LA versus USC, and our UCLA versus USC, and obviously we get kind of heated about that. And, want UCLA to win. Just to see these guys in here and see how they push each other and the, the camaraderie and everything else, these guys are going to be friends for life uh, with the work that they've done here and, and they really are building the legacy. I want to be involved with both clubs uh, and I definitely want to see them succeed. It's a race now. <laughs> because I'm only involved with SC and, and Chad's taking over UCLA, so he's got his goal to make them a champion as quick as possible, and I got my goal to make uh, UFC a champion as quick as possible. But I, I do kind of feel like I, I, I don't want to totally walk away from UCLA, even though I've handed him off. My biggest concern is, is I don't want to see the club die off. I think that uh, they need to coexist. And I think that um, that's the best thing. Uh, one can't exist without the other, in my opinion.